Good morning. This is Beekeeper Gary from Cherry City Honey. Hey, uh, I'm down at our number two bee yard uh, this morning, and I came down here to uh, to check our uh, syrup feeders. Uh, you know, with the uh, which are nice and warm, and boy, it's just a beautiful day. Uh, but uh, I come down. Uh, I get in our bee yards every day. With this warm weather, we've got a lot of uh, a lot of uh, hungry bees out, and they're they're trying to store up as much uh, as much honey as they can, or much sugar, you know, to get them through the winter. And so I come down here just to look and see, uh, you know, really how much uh, uh, you know syrup is uh, coming through the little channels in the bucket, because I want to make sure that. Uh, that they can keep packing that sugar into their hives, uh, you know, right up until uh, until winter time. You know, uh, probably another couple of weeks, the bees uh, won't be flying at all. So, uh, so I got two buckets of syrup, and I mix the syrup uh, two to one. So it's uh, if you think about that, that's uh, um, it's about 24 pounds of sugar to uh, one gallon of water. So. Uh, a lot of a uh, lot of syrup there so yeah while I'm down here I'm gonna check on uh, on a few other things just to make sure that uh, that uh, all the beehives that we've winter that we have winterized uh, is looking good I like to take an opportunity to uh, to look at all the the bigger hives uh, you know just make sure the hive wraps not coming off and you know uh, just uh, just you know have a look and see uh, you know, see that the bees are flying. Boy, they're busy this morning. Uh, you know, I really like this hive wrap. You know, this uh, this hive wrap it uh, it kind of protects the entrances of the hives from the from the high winds and things out here in the country. Um, also, blowing snow and blowing rain. You know, this is just a really durable hive wrap. So, I just uh, take time to look at all these. These I also like to look at our wind breaks, make sure we haven't lost any. Uh, any uh, any wood or anything? We put the wind breaks up to to block the direct west wind off of our hives. Um, now these hives over here, these are our nukes. These are the bees that we will overwinter. These are little individual hives, and uh, we will sell these uh, uh, next spring. So, all right, I'm going to walk back to the uh, to the rear part of the bee yard. Into the this bee yard's really made into two halves. And uh, you know you can see it's beautiful. Uh, boy, look at the at all the different colors of leaves. The leaves are falling this morning. Really beautiful out this morning. But uh, yeah, I'm gonna walk back into the back half of the bee yard here. Yeah, it looks like all the uh, all of these uh, small hives are look like they're all uh, doing well. I mean, lots of bees flying this morning. Uh, See, they're dragging some wax paper out. We some of the hives we've had to put food in. Um, we make up these winter patties, and uh, and the bees are really particular about their hives. They like to any paper or anything. They like to drag it out of the hive and get it out of there. So, uh, so I'm just looking at the bees just to you know make sure that uh, looks like there's a lot of bees out flying and uh, just. Make sure that nothing's uh, come apart or anything. Make sure no animals has got into anything. And look at all the wind breaks. So I'm going to look at the bucket feeders back here. Yeah, you can see these uh, these bees are pretty uh, pretty busy here. A lot of bees on the on the buckets. You know the uh, I like to push down on the buckets and get some air into the upper you know to push some of the uh, syrup out and uh, and you know you can see the bees are just feeding on the little troughs of syrup so and they're pretty nice to me I'm I'm not bothering their hives I did get stung this morning but I guess that was that goes with the territory so uh, hey I just wanted to show you uh, uh, you know what we're looking at this morning uh, beautiful morning I tell you we gotta enjoy these days while we've got them so, uh, hey, this is Beekeeper Gary from uh, Cherry City Honey. And, uh, hey, thanks for listening to my video.